you're about to learn the highest degree of secret teachings in one of the most hidden secret societies in the entire world. You may know of the Freemasons. You may know that many of the biggest celebrities, many of the world's richest people, they're Freemasons. And you may know that the top rank in this secret society is a 33rd degree Freemason. You will not find their teachings on how to bend reality to your will because they kept them hidden from you. But you're about to get the teachings that they use to become the richest and most powerful people in the world so you can use them to get anything that you want in life. Now, how can I say that? Did I sneak into their room, steal their secrets? Am I a Freemason? No, actually on the 8th of December, 1973, a 33rd degree Freemason, Manly Palmer Hall gave a speech while accepting the highest honored rank of the Secret Society's Supreme Council of Scottish Rite. And at this invitation only ceremony, Mr. Palmer Hall broke down the number one most powerful technique Freemasons use to bend reality to their will and get anything that they want. And in this video, I'm gonna break down the three biggest ideas of this little known technique so you can use them as the most powerful manifestation tool and you don't have to be in the secret club to know it. Now, Manly Palmer Hall begins this talk by explaining the little known laws of magnetism. And he says that in order to become a high ranking Freemason, you have to understand the ancient practices related to universal magnetism, which he says is the key to manipulating reality. And this is a ancient wisdom that was used in Greece. It was used in Egypt. And one of the earliest proponents of this ancient knowledge was Pythagoras. He was the renowned Greek mathematician, philosopher who lived around 500 BCE, best known for the Pythagorean theorem for all those school geeks out there. And he was a proponent of magnetism as a very early example. Now, here's where it gets pretty interesting. Now, according to Manly Hall, magnetic energy is the cosmic glue that holds the entire universe together. Now, in this speech, he reveals the esoteric teaching within Freemasonry that what we consider empty space is actually teeming with magnetic energy. In his words, he says, quote, the atmosphere carries the magnetism of the sun but the air is not just a blend of gases. It's a conduit of invisible energies, a complex network of electromagnetic fields that interconnect and coexist without interference. Now, he says, one thing that we have learned from television is that air transmits. He's given an example of how all these different channels on a television or a radio can broadcast at the same time without disrupting one another, a bunch of interlapping and overlapping frequency signals. And that's exactly how reality works. As a 33rd degree Freemason, he says that human consciousness can tap into these invisible magnetic fields that are teeming with infinite potential energy. And modern science actually supports this view. Electromagnetic fields, EMFs, are measurable in all physical matter, whether it's a bottle of water, whether it's the chair you're sitting on, or whether it's my face or your body, it's all emanating a magnetic field that can be measured. And this is the big idea of Freemasonry, that the world around us is a vast electromagnetic field. And that summarizes big idea number one. The air in empty space around you is a massive electromagnetic field. And in just a moment, I'm gonna give you this Freemason technique and method to tap into this invisible energy so that you can bend reality to your will. Now, Manly Palmer Hall says that in Freemasonry, they believe that everything, including the human body, is just an electromagnetic field. And Curlian photography has actually captured this energy in your body. Here's a photo of Curlian photography of energy emitting from the human body. It was created by Simeon Curlian. 
It's electrophotography that captures the energy that is emanating from your body. Now, I know that that may sound a little odd, but that's the proof. But then in an everyday example, you've walked into a room before and just sense someone's bad vibes, right? You've walked into a room and all of a sudden the environment was amazing and you felt the good vibes. Subconsciously, you already know how to perceive and read energy fields. Now, where it gets interesting is Freemasons believe that your thoughts, your emotions, your beliefs, they all vibrate at specific frequencies that affect your overall magnetic field. So if you think negatively, you're essentially tuning into a frequency of lack and limitation. And Mr. Hall emphasizes that your vibrational state magnetizes life circumstances in harmony with your field, that you're the creator of your own reality in the same way that a magnet draws to it similar energy. And in order to do this, they advise you to look at everything as an electromagnetic field, the house you want, the car you want, the relationship you want, the money you want. It's all electromagnetic energy. And when you grasp this, that's when the doors to manifestation unlock themselves because you see all of reality as an interconnected energy field. All you have to do is simply resonate in harmony with the energy that you desire. And then by the law of magnetism, it will come to you as naturally as two magnets stick to one another, right? Just as two magnets either attract or repel one another based on their polarity, you attract or repel circumstances based off of your magnetic field. So whether it's financial abundance, whether it's scarcity, love, loneliness, your experience reflects your inner magnetic field and that's what draws reality back to you. So the way that you create reality is because you are a cosmic electromagnetic magnet. And that my friend summarizes big idea number two, that everything is electromagnetic energy. Become a magnet for what you desire. Now, in order for you to truly use magnetism and have a proficiency at the level of a top-ranking Freemason, you have to understand that literally everything you want is energy. Manly Hall Palmer points out that a magnetic field phenomenon isn't just limited to living objects, living things, a pebble possesses electromagnetic energy. Everything in the universe is vibrating. Nothing is still. Everything, the house you want, the car you want. The reason that Freemasons believe that this is so significant is because everything that you desire in any way you want to manipulate or bend reality, it is already an existing energy signal or energy field it's just invisible in the same way that you're watching channel 10 on your television channel 14 exists it's just not within the projection of light photons on your television you have to take the little plastic clicker and change the channel except there is no plastic clicker on reality your brain is the electronic switching station that changes the electromagnetic frequency of all the light photons that are flitting and fleeting in front of you that you know as reality. Now, he ends this speech on Freemasonry saying that they believe it's the most honest way that the universe can work. Because what you're experiencing with your five senses is a visual representation of your own electromagnetic field that is projecting onto the screen of your life, your own motion picture. And by respecting these natural universal laws, you can control your electromagnetic field. And thus, you have ultimate free will and freedom over how you experience your reality. And a universe where every electromagnetic field is kept honest Meaning that what you see is what you're projecting, that that's the key to spiritual freedom. Now, I admit, when I first heard all this stuff, I was like, what? A cosmic magnetic field and all this stuff? And I understand there's science behind it. When you see Curlian photography, it starts to make a little bit more sense. 
But then I thought, okay, well, I have all these crappy belief systems and maybe you can relate to that. And I learned that psychologists tell us that we have 95% of all of our thoughts and beliefs being habitual. That Stanford University did a study where they showed that a human being has on average 65,000 thoughts a day. 95% of those are subconscious. So if you are subconsciously thinking all day long negative, you are controlling your electromagnetic field. You don't realize you're doing it because it's subconscious, it's not your fault. But when you realize it, it is your responsibility to change it. And I thought, well, why don't I turn myself into a magnet to get everything that I want? How do I do that? I have to reprogram my subconscious. And I created a success hypnosis for myself to start turning my subconscious into a magnet for what I wanted. All day long, I told myself that I'm a happy spiritual multimillionaire, that I'm selling books all over the world. That was my dream to become an author. It wasn't working, but it was what I wanted. And then I started using this success hypnosis every single day. And in a few years, I went from a self-published author selling books out of the trunk of my car, publishing books with Penguin Random House, the number one English publishing company in the world, books getting translated into other languages, building a multi-million dollar international business. And it happened because I realized finally, you and I are magnets for better or worse that are creating our reality based off of our own electromagnetic field. And if you want to turn yourself into a magnet for what you desire, check out my free success hypnosis. I actually give it away for free. About a million people from all over the world have used it. It's jakeshypnosis.com. Pinned to the comments and in the description right there down below. There you have it. You have what a 33rd degree Freemason says is the number one most powerful technique that the elites use to shape and bend reality. And now the wisdom is in your hands. It's time to see what you can actually create in your life. If you enjoy this video, I have another video breaking down some of the secret teachings of Freemasonry. I'll link it right here. You can go ahead and click that if you enjoy it. Get my free success hypnosis right there down below. Thanks for watching. Have a beautiful day.